Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. Honey, you must be Molly and Daisy. Molly, you didn't wear your scrubs. Welcome to your internship. Are you both excited to be here? I am. I think I'm going to be great at this summer internship. Uh, I'm not really that excited. Oh, well, why did you take this internship then, Molly? Uh, because my teacher said that if I didn't want to have detention for the entire summer, uh, I needed to do this internship. Really, Molly? That's the only reason? Yeah, pretty much. Well, I have some exciting news. You guys are going to be helping us in the maternity ward, taking care of these adorable babies that have just been born. That sounds an adorable and amazing. Seriously? I didn't sign up for this. Lots of pooping and diapers and throw up and ugh. This sounds like a horrible internship. I would have rather had one at Dunkin' Donuts. That way I could have eaten free donuts all day long. Molly, that's all you think about is your stomach. Trust me, these babies are so adorable. You're not going to mind changing those poopy diapers, Molly. Speak for yourself, lady. That sounds gross, disgusting, and, and, and yucky. Well, why don't we get started, guys? Wait, Molly, you definitely need a pair of scrubs. I'll go get you some. Perfect, now you're all set. These are itchy. Ah, uh, uh, they're itching me. Molly, uh, you're so annoying. Sometimes I wonder how I even got stuck with her as a sister. Okay, girls, follow me and I'll take you right to the nursery. We have so many adorable babies right now. Yeah, super adorable crying little monsters, I bet. Oh, look at them all. So cute! Oh, I want to hold this one. See, Molly? Maybe this internship is for you after all. Here you go, lady! This thing's crying! Of course she is. She's a baby. Watch this. La la la. La la la. La 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 la. See? She's all happy now. Uh. What's that smell? It's your first day on the job and your first poopy diaper, Molly. Have fun. I've got to go see patients. Bye. Daisy, you take this baby. No, she's full of doo-doo. I've got my own babies to take care of. Okay. Ugh. All right. La, la, la. La, la, la. La, la, la. laugh that's awesome okay let's change your diaper and i'm gonna put you right back to bed oh look at this little baby it says her name is amanda amanda wait a minute this baby looks a lot like amanda the adventurer well i i i think anyway <laughs> Molly, that's funny. Amanda the Adventurer is A, much older than this baby, and B, a video game and not real. But her face, it looks just like Amanda, and, and her name is Amanda. Maybe somehow she's turned back the hands of time and, and, and became a baby. I think she's adorable. Oh, I see you girls have met the little baby Amanda. Sad story, she's an orphan. Wait, what? Yeah, we don't know who her parents are. I guess nobody wanted her. I can't understand why. Isn't she adorable? I think she is. Daisy, don't you dare pick up that baby. What? Why wouldn't I? She's so cute. Hi, Amanda. I'm Daisy. Nice to meet you. Oh, look. She's totally harmless, Molly. 
Do you think that your mom and dad would be okay if Amanda stayed with you for a few nights? She's been going home with me in the evening since she's not adopted yet, but I could use a break. I've been pulling a lot of all-nighters. Uh, the answer is no, absolutely not, and can't do it, no way, nada. Molly, of course we could. Mom loves babies, and we take especially good care of her. Aww. Great! Then I'll send her home with you until we find an adoptive mom or dad. Um, uh, uh... Mr. Giggles, I had to do this horrible internship today, and it wasn't any fun. Oh, hi, Molly. I see you're telling Mr. Giggles about your day. You've been doing that since you were born, practically. You love that stuffed monkey. I really do. Mom, um, uh, so I sort of brought home some homework. You know, I'm pretty much an overachiever in everything. Why are you holding a baby from the hospital, Daisy? It's an orphan. Her name is Amanda. And the doctor asked if we could take care of her as a family for a couple of nights. Wait, what? You nominated us, Daisy? Uh, well, uh, it's been a while since I've had a newborn in the house. Yeah, tell me about it. Considering she's the Amanda the Adventurer from that evil, evil video game, I thought it was a bad idea, too. And he stopped saying that she is not. Holy guacamole, she's so rude. Well, I guess we could watch her for a few nights. That is, until she's adopted. Mom, send her back! She's evil! Oh, hi, little sweetheart. Yeah, Molly, we're evil. She's like the sweetest baby ever. Okay, girls, why don't you go ahead and change out of your scrubs and into your pajamas? It's getting late. Come on, Mr. Giggles. You're the only one that understands me. Ah, man, that internship really wore me out. Good night, Daisy. Good night, Molly. Don't forget to say good night to Mr. Giggles. Good night, Mr. Giggles. When are you going to let that stuffed animal go? It's been a, a long time since you've owned that. You're like a big kid now. You don't need a stuffed animal. Be quiet. Mr. Giggles will be with me always and forever. Now, good night, Daisy. That was an awesome night's sleep. Right, Mr. Giggles? Mr. Giggles? Mr. Giggles? Well, you had to be so loud in the morning. <sighs> I just woke up, but I haven't had any coffee yet. Daisy, Mr. Giggles is missing. I always say good morning to him, and he's not in my bed. Maybe he fell behind the bed. You do roll around a lot in your sleep. Yeah, good point. No, he's not back there. That evil Amanda the Adventurer baby. She probably took him. Molly, Amanda is a newborn. How would she take your Mr. Giggles stuffed monkey? She's just a baby. I don't know, but she's evil, I say. She's evil. Good morning, Molly. Mom, that Amanda girl, she has to get out of here. You mean the newborn that's still sleeping? What are you talking about? She stole Mr. Giggles. Molly, a newborn can't steal Mr. Giggles. Why does nobody believe me? That looks just like Amanda the Adventurer. She probably killed her woolly stuffed animal, and now she's after Mr. Giggles. And he's my best friend. Molly, oh my goodness. I don't know why you're so obsessed with this Amanda the Adventurer game, but I'm telling you, that baby Amanda has nothing to do with it. Now go eat your waffles. Molly, the waffles are still in the oven. What's, what's that smell? It smells like something's burning. There is something burning in the oven. Maybe maybe it's the waffles. Is, is that... Is that Mr. Giggles in the oven? Ah, how'd he get in there? Don't worry, Molly. Just, just pull him out and I'll spray him with the fire extinguisher. Mr. Giggles! Don't worry, we're rescuing you! Oh, man. He's got a big hole in him now. I've had this since I was a baby. He's, he's ruined. <laughs> oh my goodness. Who would put Mr. Giggles in the oven? Daisy, did you do this? What? No, I'm the good daughter. I would never do something like that. Even though Molly is the most annoying sister ever. <laughs> I'm just 
just saying I would never do something so cruel, ma'am. Well, somebody put Mr. Giggles in the oven. Don't worry, Molly. I can sew the hole back together. He'll never be the same. <laughs> He'll never be the same. But you'll still love him the same. Now, who could have done this? It was that baby. It was that evil baby. I have a good idea to find out who did this to Mr. Giggles. You do? What? Molly, it's okay, honey. I'm going to fi fix Mr. Giggles. But in the meantime, let's look at our security cameras. Wait, you have security cameras? Yeah, of course we do, in case somebody breaks in. Yeah, let's figure this out, Mom. I bet it was Amanda. Molly, Amanda is a newborn. We've go gone over this. But it wasn't Daisy, so who could it have been? <laughs> Oh my gosh, it is Amanda the Adventurer. How did it get to be a baby? I don't know, but that was the creepiest thing I've ever seen. Oh my gosh, we have to take that baby back to the hospital right now. Come on, we'll get her and we'll take her right back to the hospital where she came from. Okay, Mom. Wait, Mom? Where's Amanda? She was... She was here. I, I put her to sleep and, and I just checked on her this morning, not that long ago. Oh my God, she's escaped into Brookhaven and she probably wants to kill us all. Is she under the bed? Mom, no, she escaped. Did you not catch that? She probably wants to kill us all. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can't believe this. An evil baby is a psycho and on the loose. Yep. This is how the story ends. Well, no, not really, because, you know, you still have Mr. Giggles, even if he does have a hole in him now. Mr. Giggles, I'm sorry. I'm sorry this happened to you. I, I love you anyway, though, even though you're a little charred from being in the oven. Molly, we have to stop this Amanda the Adventurer before it's too late. Oh, I'm so thirsty. Molly, we just had breakfast five minutes ago. I know, but I need some milk. I need some milk! Uh, you're so lucky. I wish I could drink some milk. What? Why? Excuse me, we're trying to have a conversation. Rude! Molly, don't say that. They'll put you in time out. So, Daisy, why can't you drink any milk? My tummy just feels kind of funny today. Uh, it's even sticking out farther than it normally does. You know what that means? It means you gotta fart! <laughs> Repeat after me. <laughs> Ew, Molly, you probably went doo-doo in your diaper. Good morning, girls. Who's ready to ride the ponies? Oh, Molly, you look so sad. What's wrong? I have to tinkle. I tinkle potty. Okay, come with me. And then we're going to go ride the ponies. Aren't you excited? Yeah, I I'm pretty excited. I'm really thirsty, though. Okay, go ahead. Sit on the potty. Can I have a drink? I need some milk. Hello? Hello? Uh-oh, she left. I can't believe she left me all alone on the potty. What if I fall in? What if I What if I go down to the sewer and I drown? Um, Molly, I think you're being a little dramatic. I'm right here, and you're just fine. Now go wash your hands, please. Okay, fine. I can't believe she left me there alone. Terrible caregiver! Molly, I think you're just a little grumpy. Maybe you need a snack before we ride the ponies? Yeah, I need a snack. Of course I do. You always get so hangry. Um, is Daisy going to have a snack too? I don't buy a snack. I don't feel good. Oh, Daisy, your stomach still hurts? Well, maybe you're just hungry, sweetheart. Why don't we try feeding you something? All right, Molly, let's just put you in your high chair and give you a snack and a drink, and then we'll go ride the ponies. Okay, mmm, rice, mmm, this is delicious. Daisy, are you sure you don't want any? No, my stomach hurts so bad. I think there might be something wrong with me. Oh, honey, it's probably just, just like a little, a little tummy upset. You'll be okay. I'm feeling pretty good. I ate tons of rice and it was delicious and then I had a bottle of milk. Ah, my tummy is so happy. 
My tummy feels awful. Well, maybe once you ride the ponies, you'll feel better, Daisy. Come on, let's go. Oh, look it, I think that pony really likes me. Hi, I'm Molly. Molly, horses don't speak English. Oh, well, maybe they speak horse. Because Yes, I can. Ooh, here comes a unicorn. Or Pegasus. I think it's a Pegasus because it's got wings. I want to ride the Pegasus. Okay, the Pegasus obviously wants me to ride it, but I don't, I don't know how to get on its back. I'm too little. Teacher, help me. There you go, Molly. You just needed a little bit of help. Yeah. <laughs> this is fun. Whee! Um, and also, that's not a Pegasus. That's a flying unicorn. Flying unicorn? Whoa. The wings are beautiful. Um, can you stop going so fast, though? You're making my tummy hurt. Tell me about it. My tummy's been hurting all day. Okay, girls. Well, since your tummies are both hurting, maybe it's time to go for a nap. Or maybe it's time to go to the hospital. Oh. I don't feel right. I want to see a doctor right now. Oh, Daisy, it's really that bad? Yeah, she's been telling you. Uh-oh. Oh, my gosh. She just threw up everywhere. All over that girl. Oh, no. I don't feel good. Ew, you threw up on me. Gross. Does anyone have any paper towels? Um, no, but you could go to get some at the nurse's station. Oh, Daisy, this is making me so sad that you're so sick. Girls, we need to take Daisy to the hospital and quick. Daisy, everything's gonna be okay, I promise. Molly, my stomach, it hurts so, so bad. Oh no, Daisy, I'm so sorry this is happening to you. You're the most annoying sister in the world, but I hate to see you sick. I know, it's just so awful. <laughs> well, the doctor's gonna know what to do, I know it. They're gonna make you all better. May I have your attention, please? The next patient is Daisy. I need to go potty. I'm going to throw up. Oh, uh, you better hurry up. She she needs a wheelchair. Somebody help. I don't need a wheelchair. I have to go to the bathroom. And also, I think I'm going to throw up again. Not on me. Oh, my gosh. I don't want to get thrown up on yuck. Do you have a bucket, Molly? Oh, my stomach. Hi there. I'm Dr. Smith, and I'd be happy to help your sister. Well, you better hurry because she's about to go poo-poo in her pants, and she's throwing up. Oh, my. Okay, sweetheart, just get right into the wheelchair, and I'll take you into the exam room. And are you okay, little girl? My name's Molly, and yeah, I'm just really tired. Having a sister that's sick is exhausting. Right this way, sweetheart. Everything's going to be a-okay. I hope so. I, I really need a drink. I want some milk, and I want my mommy. I want my mommy, too. Well, your mommy's at work, but don't worry. She's been called. She'll be here as soon as possible. Now, I just need you to lay down in this bed so we can do a checkup and see if there's something wrong with your tummy. Okay, Daisy, let's take a look at your tummy. First, I'm going to put a little bit of pressure on your tummy, and I'm going to feel for any bumps or lumps. I'm feeling very sick. When I turn you or twist you this way, does your tummy hurt? Yes, it hurts so bad. All right. We're gonna need to get an x-ray of your stomach and maybe an ultrasound too. Oh my gosh, is that gonna hurt? No, neither one of those hurt at all. Now, come on, Daisy. Oh my gosh, I'm so worried about my sister. Oh man. I also have to go to the bathroom. I'm really thirsty and I need a nap. Worst day ever! <laughs> What's happening, doctor? What did you find out? Well, we did the x-ray and your sister has to have her appendix out. Wait. What? I want to have surgery. <laughs> Don't worry, sweetie. You won't feel a thing because you'll be asleep. And when you wake up, you'll eat all the ice cream you can stand. Whoa, sounds pretty good to me, Daisy. Could I have surgery too? I want to eat ice cream. I don't want to. <laughs> all right, sweetie. I'm just going to lay you on the operating table and give you some medicine that'll help you fall asleep. When you wake up, your mom will be here and everything will be all over and your tummy won't hurt anymore. Oh my gosh, I can't believe my sister's going to have surgery at Twilight Daycare. Do they do surgery here? 
Yes, we have doctors on staff for such things. Now you'll have to wait in the waiting room, Molly. You can't be in the surgery room, of course. Of course. Oh my gosh, my poor sister. Will she be okay? Will she survive? Oh my gosh, I'm so worried about my sister. She's so annoying, but... Wait a minute. I'm worried about her, but I'm also feeling kind of hungry. Where's the snack bar? I totally need to go get a snack. Ooh, a snack bar full of donuts? Yes, please. Oh my gosh, I'm so hungry. All right, let's see how much everything costs. Ooh, $2. I probably can afford that, I think. Give me a donut! My sister's in the hospital, I need it! Oh, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was delicious. Can I buy another one? Oh, I'm totally gonna eat all these donuts until I explode. Mm. May I have your attention, please? May I have your attention, please? Daisy has just finished surgery. Daisy has just finished surgery. Oh, wow. I can't stay here and eat all these donuts. I gotta go see my sister. Daisy? Daisy, are you okay? I feel kind of funny. My stomach doesn't really hurt anymore, though. I want my mommy! Oh, Daisy, mom's gonna be here any minute. I just know it. How was the surgery? I don't know. I don't remember anything. All I know is they said, count to three. I went one, two. No, I woke up over here. I guess the surgery's over. Yeah, the surgery's over, Daisy. Now they said you could eat as much ice cream as you want. But that's good, because I'm very hungry if I'm not eating all day. Oh, I'm so glad you can eat again, and that your stomach doesn't hurt anymore. Yeah, except for they told me after the surgery I would have to fart a lot. Say what? Yeah, and I'm sort of feeling... Ew, Daisy! Gassy. <laughs> oh my gosh, that smells awful! Oh, it's making me want to... Ew, Molly! Sorry, you stink so bad. Gross! Oh, you're so dramatic. I want my mom. I want my mom! Daisy already told you she's coming any minute. She's going to take you home, and then you're not going to be able to go to um, Twilight Daycare for at least probably a week because you had surgery. Yeah, but that's okay. I'll stay home and eat ice cream and watch all the TV I want while you have to come and do class and homework and stuff. Wait, what? I have to come even though you don't? That sounds completely unfair. Oh, it is, Molly. All you have to do is have surgery. I don't want surgery, but I don't want to come to school every day. Uh, Molly, that's just the way educational daycare is. And since you're not sick, you get to do all the homework. I don't like this. I don't like this at all! Molly, give me that TV remote. I don't think so. I'm watching Brooke hot. Molly, give me it. It's my turn with the TV. <laughs> you can catch me. Nee, 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 nee. Oh, yeah, Molly? Watch me. Ah! Are you, are you spraying me with a fire extinguisher? Daisy, that's so rude. Give it to me, Molly. I want to watch the news. Seriously? What are you, 100? Why would you want to watch the news? Boring. Molly, turn the channel to the news station. Oh, my goodness, my sister's such a brat. I'll show you right now, Lydia. I can't believe I'm on the news. This is super cool. Whoa. Uh, and now you never have to water again? That's right. I just give my plants a little pat, though, because I want them to know I still care about them. Oh, that's sweet. Wow. I don't have feelings so good. Oh, I feel very strange. You're probably just nervous from being on TV. That happens to a lot of people. I want to eat your brains. What? What did you just say? I want to eat your brains. Ah! Oh my god, the owner of, of Dr. Green Thumb has turned into a zombie. You heard it first, folks, here on News Channel 10. This could be the story of a lifetime. Oh my gosh, the new potion that Dr. Dr. Green Thumb's business created turns everything green into a zombie infection. That's right, Brookhaven residents. Don't touch the color green! Unless, of course, you want to be a brain-eating zombie. Molly, did you hear that? That, 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 that sounds insane! What? <laughs> I think 
they must be joking. Is it April Fool's Day? No, Molly. It's not April Fool's Day. It's July. April Fool's Day happens in April. Okay, well, that can't be true. Every green plant in Brookhaven, if you touch it, will turn you into a zombie? That would be like the end of the universe. Yeah, well, I think it must be true because I saw it on the news. Nah, the news is full of fluff. And, um, I think it's a lot of... Oh, Marley, did you just fart? Yeah, it's a lot of doo-doo, that's what it is. Oh, boy, Marley, please tell me you won't touch the color green. Please! Hey, Molly, what's up? Oh, you playing some soccer? Hey, Brookie, nice to see you. Did you see the news? Uh, no, I never watch the news. It bores me so much. Me too. So, you didn't hear anything weird going on in Brookhaven? No, not at all. Wanna hang out? Yeah, sure. Okay, let me just go put my bike over there in the grass. Um, I don't think you should touch the... Uh, don't, don't touch the... Oh, don't be silly, Molly. That was just a prank. Oh, wow. I don't feel so good. Uh... Brookie? Oh, my God. It wasn't a prank. Molly, how could you? The news was telling the truth. Uh, don't look now, but our BFF is having some major problems. <laughs> brains. Give me all your brains. Yeah, I should say so. Poor Brookie. I never thought that it would come to this. Well, as long as we don't touch the color green, everything should be fine, right, Daisy? Yeah, exactly. We can avoid the color green, like, forever, right? Yeah, totally. So sad. I lost my best friend to the zombie apocalypse. Molly, your shirt! It has green on it! A little green alien! Huh, what? Ah! Oh, my God. And so is it everything green? Because I've been touching this the whole time and I'm not a zombie. Oh, maybe it's just the plants and the trees and everything living, so your shirt is okay. Oh, hopefully the whole town isn't a zombie yet. I'm gonna go out and take a look. Okay, the door won't open now. Uh -huh. Unlock! Uh, I'm gonna go to Starbucks and get a cupcake. What a stressful day! Ooh, look at that green apple. That looks delicious. No! Don't touch that! Didn't you watch the news? What? No, I'm starving. Ah! You're touching the color green! Oh my gosh, you're gonna turn into a zombie. What are you talking about? I think this apple tastes fine. Ugh, my stomach kind of hurts now. I guess I wasn't that hungry. Here you go, you can have it. Oh, ah! Why did I catch that? Oh my god, no, no, no! Oh, I don't feel so good. Uh-oh, it's happening, isn't it? I'm gonna turn into a zombie! Brains, brains. Why can't I get, I get up off the ground? I'm a lazy zombie. Ugh, so much like my human self. Molly? No! Molly, not you too! My sister! No! Molly, you stay back. Stay back from me, Molly! Uh, I want to eat your brain, sister. I am so hungry. I better go to my science lab, try to reverse this horrible potion. Molly, please! Oh no! Brains! Wanna eat your brains? Let me in! Don't you want a nice delicious cupcake, Molly? You love cupcakes! Yes! Brain cupcakes! Stop saying brains! Brains! Wow, you're even annoying as a zombie. Go figure. I've been working night and day for an entire week. But I think I know how to reverse the zombie apocalypse that's happening. All I have to do is mix up this potion, and I should be able to cure all of Brookhaven by putting a few drops in the water source. I just hope I'm not too late for my sister Molly. As annoying as she is, she's more annoying wanting to eat my brains. City of Brookhaven, don't worry. Scientist Daisy will cure you all. I'm on my way. Uh-oh. Did I just touch the color green? Oh, no. I've doomed all of Brookhaven. It's happening. It's happening. All of Brookhaven is now zombified. Brains. I want brains.
just woke up and now I'm gonna watch some YouTube videos of my favorite Roblox games. Hey, why doesn't the Wi-Fi password work? What's going on? Mom, the Wi-Fi doesn't work. That's because Molly, you're grounded. Wait, what? Yeah, remember yesterday you came home with another detention slip and I grounded you for three days? But, but mom, I'm trying to get um YouTube. I mean, yeah, and I'm telling you that you're grounded from YouTube and all electronics for three days. But, 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 but mom! Sorry, Molly, no can do. No electronics for three whole days. Maybe you'll take school a bit more seriously in the future. But I have to talk to Brookie! And, and then the only way I can is with electronics. Unless, of course, she comes over, but how will she know to come over if I don't call her or text her? Um, she can't come over, Molly. You're grounded. I can't even see my friends! This is like being in prison! Oh, uh, yeah, pretty much, Molly. I don't like my life right now. I don't like it. I like my life because I eat apple and I like apples. Well, good for you! Molly, don't snap at your baby sister. It's not her fault you got grounded. I know exactly what will make me feel better. Uh, 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 I don't think so. Not one more bite of that, Molly. Wait, what? Why? No sweets when you're grounded. You may choose to have an apple or a banana or some vegetables. This is like prison. You're even telling me what I can't can and can't eat? Mom! I'm the mom here, so I'm in charge. Besides, it won't hurt you to eat healthy for a couple of days, Molly. It will. It will kill me, Mom. It will kill me! See, Mom? I'm dead. I'm dead, Mom! I'm dead! Oh, Molly, you're being so dramatic. She's not dead, Mom. She's still talking. I hear it. <laughs> but I'll cry and pretend it's really sad. Ugh. You have a flair for drama too, don't you, baby Kira? Okay, Molly, why don't you get off the floor? You have some extra chores to do. Blink, 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 blink. Get up, Molly, get up, get up. Extra chores? No, nope. I'll just stay down here on the floor. Huh, I, I think this is better. Molly, you have extra chores to do because you're grounded. Now, come on, let's get started. I'll do chores later. <sighs> I need to relax and watch some TV. I just got up. Who, gets, who does chores when they first wake up? That's just insanity. I like the show. I like the pop puppies and kittens. Molly, no TV for you. I like TV, though. Yeah, you can watch TV lady, later, baby Kira, because I don't want Molly to be tempted to watch any TV. Wait a minute. No electronics, no sweets, no TV, no friends. This is the worst few days of my life. And to top it off, here's the mop, Molly. <laughs> now, get started on your chores. Oh, boy. Daisy, what are you doing? I'm shopping and just relaxing. Oh, why don't I get to do what I want? This stinks. I don't like this at all. Well, maybe you don't get detention so much, Molly. Maybe you don't get detention so much, Molly. <laughs> oh, that's real mature. Oh, I'm so tired. Wait a minute. I have a perfect idea. A brilliant, amazing idea. Oh, baby Kira. Yeah, my ways. I have this delicious candy bar and also my iPad. And you can have both of them for the day if you help me out with some chores. Really? I don't have my own iPad. I always want to play on one. Yeah, you can watch uh, Baby Shark 5,000 times on YouTube if you want to. Baby Shark. Do, 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 baby Shark. Do, 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 baby Shark. Do, 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 baby Shark. Okay, that's enough of that. Um, Yep, so all you have to do is just take this mop. And, um, you know, just do all my chores. Wait, wait, that's it? Yep, that's it. There you go. Take it. Take it. Take it! Okay, I take it. Um, I don't really know how I mop. It's okay. See what I'm doing here? Just mopping back and forth. Everything's good. See? I get it. Okay. I'm pretty good at mopping, right? Um, yeah, sure. Good enough, I guess. Who cares? Ah, that's much better. Now I can chill and watch some TV. I'm up at the horse. I'm gonna watch the iPad.
bed. Oh, I guess I'm on the couch. Oopsie. Hey, don't get any on the couch. Ah, uh, why do I care? Yeah. Mom will never know the difference. Don't mop me. Oh, now I smell like pine salt. Oh, look at these adorable puppies. Oh, the dentist. Blah. Survivor. Perfect. Molly, you're going to get in so much trouble for having baby Kira doing your chores when you're the grounded one. <laughs> and you know what else? I'm going to eat a Reese's too. Oh, yeah. This is going to be amazing. Mm. Get in my belly. <sighs> Molly? What? I, I don't have any candy. What are you talking about? What are you doing, Molly? Um, uh, uh, maybe Kira wanted to do that, and who am I to deny her of her, her, her right to clean? Molly, did you tell your baby sister you'd do something if you, if you, if you had her do your chores? Yeah, she did. Daisy, you're the biggest tattletale ever. You goody two-shoes. Molly, that's it. I've had enough. Um, uh, had enough of what? My charming personality? <laughs> oh, you are the problem, child, for sure. Okay, that's it. You're grounded for an extra three days. What? Mom, you can't be serious. I came to catch with the mom. I'm good at it. Oh my gosh, baby Kira, you're gonna ruin the furniture. Molly, that's gonna have to come out of your allowance. What? Double what? I don't think so, Mom. That's my allowance. And you must learn that there are consequences when you do things that are wrong. Now, get started on the laundry, Molly. Okay. Oh man, that really backfired on me. I guess I have no choice but to actually do all these chores. This is gonna be the worst six days of my life. chores. Uh, are they leaving popcorn kernels on the floor? Be more careful! Oh my gosh, this episode of Brook High is hilarious, Daisy. I know why you girls like to watch this now. Now that Molly was doing all the chores, I actually had time to sit and watch TV. It's crazy. Yes! Mom, I, I, I can't do any more chores, please! Okay, Molly, you did a really great job. I'm very proud of you for actually following instructions. Really? Ah, I'm so tired now. Yeah, I've decided that you're only grounded for today. And your grounding is over. Really? Oh, Mom, thank you! I'll never forget this kindness. Not ever! Mama, I poo-poo in my pants. I need diaper. Um, actually, Molly, on second thought, your grounding is over as soon as you change baby Kira's poopy diaper. Wait, what? Yep, <laughs> that's your last punishment for getting detention. And it's sort of because I want to just sit here and not change it. Oh, man. Ew, baby Kara, you smell awful. Sorry, not done. Oh, boy. I've got to try to never have detention ever again. I don't want to use a potty chair. Um, you have to be a big girl now and use the potty if you want to go to the water park today. No, I'm gonna go poop in my diaper. Oh, that's not what big girls do. Too late. Oh, Molly. All right, I guess we'll have to give you a bath. I don't want a bath either. Well, if you have to be a naughty baby, then you're gonna have to sit in time out instead of going to the water park. You don't want that, do you? No, I just don't want a bath. Well, I'm getting ready for the water park. See, see my cute little outfit? This is exactly what I got to go to the water park, and you can get a cute little outfit to go too, as long as you're good. Now, you need to take a little nap, and then we'll be all ready to go. La, la, la. I'm not going to sleep, lady. Oh, come on, I'll sing you the nicest lullaby. I'm not going to sleep. Oh wait, no, no, yes I am. <laughs> It seems that you 
both have a little bit of a cough. <coughs> I'm gonna go to the water park, you promise, lady! Well, first we need to give you some cough medicine because Daisy's got a cough too. Yeah, and I kind of want to go home. Daisy, you don't want to go home. We're not calling Mom. We're going to the water park. I had to try to go to the bathroom and the potty, and then I had to get a bath. I had to do all this stuff, and, and I'm going to that water park. Well, I'm kind of hungry, too. Are you hungry, Molly? No. <coughs> I just have this cough I can't get rid of. Okay, girls. Well, here we are at the doctor's office. I just need to give you a little bit of cough medicine, and you probably will feel good enough to go to the water park, okay? I'm better, lady. Oh, wow. I do feel all better. <laughs> I'm going to go to the water park. Yay! Molly, wait up. I need to take my medicine, too, and then we can go to Kevl. Not waiting. OMG. I can't wait to see it. It's going to be beautiful. I know this new water park is going to be amazing. <gasps> it totally is. Look at it. Donut water park. My kind of water park. It's amazing. There's an ice cream truck out front. And then, and then there's water and there's slides and there's there's beach balls and there's pools and OMG. It's amazing. Dizzy, seriously, are you crying at the water park? I was for a minute, but now I'm super happy. Why were you crying? I, I, I'm just so excited. I can't take it. Oh my gosh, my sister's kind of cray cray. Girls, don't go in water that's over your head, though, okay? Um, yeah, we'll try not to, but no promises. <laughs> Girls, do you either one of you know how to, to swim? Uh, no. Well, I guess you could have swim lessons. Nah, we don't need swimming. We'll be just fine. Actually, if you're in the water and you don't know how to swim, then you need to be wearing a life jacket. Oh, this lady, nag, 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 nag. Going down the water slide. It's gonna be whoa, super fun! Whee! Um, now might be a time to worry about not being able to swim! Ah, I can't swim! Help! Help! Buddy, just stand up. The water's not even deep now, cheapers. Ow! Oh, I hit my knee and I scraped it. <laughs> it's making me mad! Whoa! It sounds like someone needs a time out. Come on, Molly, turn that frown upside down. We could splash in the water park. It'll be fun. You're, you're ugly. Oh. What? Oh. Molly, why did you say that? <laughs> That's it, Molly. Time out for you. That's such a mean thing to say. Why are you so grumpy? I just am. It's because I'm a baby. <laughs> All right, well, time out for you, my dear. Why don't you stand right there and think about what you did and said, and when you're ready to join us and be a good girl, you can get out of time out. Fine! I don't like you anyway, lady. Look at my knee. It's got a cut on it. I hit it on the bottom of the pool, and no one even cares. Molly, you're supposed to be t spending this time thinking about what you said to Daisy. I hurt my knee, lady. I hurt my knee. Oh, wow. You hurt your arm and your knee. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe you scraped the bottom of the pool, Molly. Everything will be okay. Um, It just looks like they're little scrapes. I want my mommy. La, la, la. La, la, la. La, la, la. Is this lady for real right now? That's not helping. Molly, just try to listen to this. Hush, little baby, don't say a word. I'm gonna buy you a mockingbird. Whoa, that's working. I don't want it to work. I'm, I want to be grumpy. Molly, come on, you're at the water park. Don't you want to have a good time? Yeah, okay. Now remember what I said, be careful in the water, okay? And no more timeouts. Okay, fine. Come on, Daisy, let's go down another slide. I don't know. I can't swim. And I saw what happened to you. You got a scrape. Yeah, but don't be a chicken. Come on, let's go. Oh, man, this one looks super, super, super cool. It's like a rainbow slide. Whoa! Whoa! Uh-oh, I'm stuck. Teacher! I need help. I'm stuck in the water slide. Uh-oh. I'm, I'm never going to be able to come down here. Wait, wait. I think I just walked down it. Molly, are you okay? 
Yeah, I got stuck in the water slide, but... Oh, whoa, my teacher came right up here and got me. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. We are magic like that, Molly. Uh, teacher? Daisy's under the water. Daisy! Daisy! Oh my gosh, are you okay? I think I might have been drowning, but I'm okay. Um, Daisy, that's, that's not okay to be drowning. Girls, you need to be careful. This water is only as deep as your knees, but the two of you keep going under the water. Be very careful. We will. Hey, don't, don't splash me. You'll, you'll mess up my makeup. You're going to the water park, lady. Why'd you care about your makeup? Oh, I guess you're right. Come on, let's have a splash fight. Yeah. I'm thirsty. Well, drink some of this water I'm splashing at you. Ha, ha, ha. Food, Molly. Daisy, there's nothing wrong with drinking pool water. I think it's delicious. Ew, Molly, probably someone with pee-pee in there. Yeah, me. I had to go. Ew, Molly, do you know what you're just saying right now? <coughs> Ew, gross. <coughs> oh, it's not that gross. Try it. You need water and there's a whole lot here. Molly peed in the pool. Molly, uh, this is our ool. Please leave the pee out. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> that was super funny. <laughs> Maybe you babies are just too little to bring to the water park. Wait, what? No. No, lady, we're not too we're not too little. Uh, I don't know, Molly. Maybe next year you'll be mature enough to come to the water park. Right now, though, I think we better take you both to the potty and have something to eat. And maybe a nap. What? No! I'm gonna go back to the water park! I only rode like two slides! And for right now, that's enough. You kids have needs, and eating and drinking and going to the potty chair are all things you need to do. That's lame. I want to wear a diaper forever. I don't. I want to be a big girl. I don't want to be peeing in the water park pool. Well, I don't care. I want to be at the water park, so if I have to pee in the pool, I don't care. But I don't, I don't want to sit on this potty chair anymore. Getting off of it. Good job, Molly. You peed in the potty. I didn't want to, though. You forced me to. I am hungry, though. Let's have a snack and let's go back to the pool. Can you be good, Molly? Um, yeah, sure. I can be really good. <laughs> Watch this. Oh, do I not have enough money? I really want to slime my teacher. Hmm, I've got to think of another way to be naughty. <laughs> I know how to be naughty. I took Daisy's favorite rubber ducky. Now she won't have it for bath time at Twilight Daycare. <laughs> oh, I love being evil. Molly, have you seen my rubber ducky? Um, no, I haven't seen it at all. Molly, you're holding my rubber ducky. Girls, are you fighting again? Yeah, but you're not the lady who takes care of us, so bye. Rude. I can still report you and give you time out. She took my bubble ducky. Yep, because I'm naughty, and everybody knows it. <laughs> Molly, you dropped that bubble ducky right now. Not a chance. Molly, did you take Daisy's toy? You're not going to go back to the water park. I'm going back. I, I, wait, why are you picking me up, lady? You're not going back. You're being very naughty. You know what that means? You need a nap. No, I don't want a nap. Get, let go of me. Let, let go. Molly, you need a nap. Now get in your crib. I'm going to give you two seconds. Hey, fine, I'm in here. But I'm not going to sleep, lady. I'm not doing it. I don't want to take a nap. Oh my gosh, this Roblox game is so much fun. Molly, you're not supposed to be playing on that. You're grounded. But mom, I've been grounded for three days now. You're not studying for your test like you're supposed to, Molly. Mermaid school is very important, especially for a princess like you. I don't want to be a princess. I'm tired of being a princess. Molly, this is your fate in life. You're meant to be a mermaid princess and one day a mermaid queen. Now get off of your computer. Maybe next time you'll you'll take mermaid school a little more seriously. Fine. <laughs> I'm so sick of being grounded. <laughs> Molly, try to turn your frown upside down. Go away, Daisy. Get out of my room. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm just here to try to make you feel better. 
Nothing can make me feel better. I hate being a mermaid princess. Oh, Molly, it's not so bad. If you do your mermaid homework, you wouldn't get grounded. I don't like homework. It stinks. Well, Mom only grounded you from certain things, not everything. What are you talking about? What I'm saying is she didn't ground you from going outside. And if you go outside, there's plenty of fun things to do. We could get ice cream. We could play hide and seek. Whoa, you're right. <laughs> Mom can't say no to that. She didn't ground me from those things. Mom, Mom, where are you? Mom, Mom. Oh, there you are, Mom. Oh, hi. I'm just waving to my loyal fans. The kingdom needs me. And also, I'm drinking some coffee. <laughs> yeah, Mom. Um, well, I thought of something you didn't ground me from. Going outside, getting fresh air. Yeah, Mom, you can't deny you from getting fresh air. A mermaid needs it. Well, I guess. But be back in two hours, Molly. Okay, Mom. Thanks. Bye, girls. And Molly, stay out of trouble. No promises. Molly, come on. Let's go to the cafe. Oh, yeah, that sounds delicious. I haven't had a cupcake in days. Coral Cafe, one of my absolute favorites. What kind of deliciousness did they bake up today? Ooh, let's see. Um, oh, they don't, do they have any snacks? I don't want just a drink, but um, first of all, I'm gonna have a dark roast with um, chocolate drizzle. And um, wait, I need a cupcake. I need a cupcake! Molly, your face looks weird in your mug. <laughs> Look at me, blah, blah. Oh, boy, you're ridiculous. <laughs> okay, um, where's the dark roast? Oh, yeah, there it is. Um, Molly, sorry to say, the cafe doesn't have any cupcakes today. What? Doesn't have any cupcakes? Are you serious right now? Oh, my gosh, this day couldn't get any worse. Well, at least you're going to get a delicious coffee with chocolate drizzle. Yeah, at least I'm going to get that. The chocolate flavor, what else do they have? Ooh, actually, I think I want vanilla. Because I got dark roast, so I'm going to get like a, just like a squirt of that. Ooh, that looks delicious. I mean, not as delicious if I was eating a cupcake with it, but you know, whatever. Wait, what? Where'd my, where'd my drink go? Molly, did you have enough money to pay for it? Um, no, I thought that they were doing it for free. Molly, of course they did it. Oh boy, you didn't even get a coffee, did you? No, I'm starting to get grumpy. I'm gonna go home and pow. Molly, don't go home and pow. Let's just go outside and play or something. We can play hide and seek if you want. Not so fast, little mermaid babies. Who are you calling a baby? I I'm potty trained. Molly, it's, 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 it's this sea witch. Sea witch? But she hasn't been in, in Mermaid Land for a hundred years. Well, I'm back. And I need two mermaid babies to be my evil minions. We're not interested. Go find someone else. I think the queen's daughters would be perfect. I can curse you, you know. And you'll be my minions forever. Oh my gosh. What are we going to do? Dizzy, we have to figure out a way to escape. Molly, you distract her. I'll go make a hot coffee and pull it on her tail. She'll, she'll be distracted for sure. Okay, Daisy. Excuse me, um, I have some questions about being a minion. Oh, such a great student. You won't need to know anything though once I cast this evil spell on you. You'll just do it. Take this, evil witch! kingdom i just know it a queen must know how to wave i practice my wave two times every day morning and night mom 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 molly what is it i'm a little busy doing my wave exercises i am queen you know mom she really needs to tell you something important the, 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 the evil sea witch what about the evil sea witch she's been imprisoned for over a hundred years well she escaped and she still looks really young. She must have some sort of youth potion. What are you talking about? She escaped. Is this some sort of prank? No, Mom. 
It's not a prank at all. She escaped and, and, and she wants to turn us into her minions. What? My two precious daughters? She's telling the truth, Mom. She, she, she wants to turn, a, it, turn your daughters into minions. Molly and I will, 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 will be evil. I knew this day would come, especially after your father died, leaving me defenseless. But little does she know, I've been learning karate. Uh, Mom, I think karate would be a little difficult with a mermaid tail. Nonsense! Look at how I swish my tail. I can take down any enemy. Yeah, except for if she comes with like an entire minion, um, you know, like army. Oh, good point, Molly. Well, your father and I talked about this before his untimely passing, and the only thing we could think to do was to make you girls human and leave Mermaid Land forever in order to keep you safe. Say what? Become human? But, but Mom, would you come with us? No, I'd have to stay here and fight. The sea witch must go down. Now, you girls must make haste. Head for the shore. What? Mom, we're not leaving you here with that evil witch. Yeah, Mom, we're not doing it. Girls, you have to. You'll be happy as humans, and one day I'll come for you again. Now go before the sea witch gets here. <laughs> Girls, I heard her evil laugh. She's at the front door. Quick, make an escape through the balcony before she gets you. Come on, Daisy, we've gotta go. Whoa, what happened? Where am I? Daisy? Molly, why are we in the water? I, 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 I don't understand what's going on. And where are we? I don't know, that sign says, welcome to Brookhaven? Where are my pants? I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not wearing any pants. Well, look at my outfit. I mean, it's like it's like I've never had legs before, and I can't remember where I was before anything. I know it's like I have amnesia. How did I get down here to the ocean? Super strange. I don't know who our parents are even. Me either. I guess we should head to the adoption center. The two mermaid princesses didn't remember that they were mermaids. They only knew each other's names, but they didn't remember who their parents were or anything else about their lives. They had to start their lives over again as humans. And it wasn't going to be easy. First, they would need to go to the adoption center and get new parents. And hopefully Mermaid Land wasn't being destroyed by the evil sea witch. Daisy, look, it's an adoption center. Maybe we could find some parents here. Molly, we must have got bonked on the heads. Maybe we should go to the hospital. Um, I don't know. Let's try the adoption center first. Maybe they'll know what to do. Good point, Molly. Good point. Whoa! Um, where are your pants? I'm sorry. I don't know what happened to my pants. She could use some new ones, though. Do you have any spare pants? Um, yeah, sure. Wait a minute. Do you guys need adoption? Have you been living on the streets? Pants first! Okay, okay, pants. And I got you some new clothes, too. They're nice and clean. Thank you. We really appreciate it. Now, tell me, what's going on, girls? And what are your names? Well, I'm Molly. And I'm Daisy, and, and we just sort of woke up in the ocean. Wait, what? Did you fall off the side of a boat? Do you have a concussion? Maybe you should go to the hospital. I don't know. I mean, we don't remember anything. Okay, well, um, do you, do you think that you fell off the side of a boat? Do you think you have a concussion? We don't know! But we don't think so. We don't think we have parents. Oh, wow. Um, well, I can definitely help you here. This is the adoption center, and this is where we find you new parents. Oh, wow. That would be amazing. Right, Daisy? As long as my sister and I can stick together. But first, I think we should go to the hospital and see if anyone claims you. And have your heads checked out. Okay, well, let's go do it. Marley, I don't think there's anything wrong with us. I don't feel like I got a bonk on the head. I don't know, but this bed is kind of comfy, so I'm just going to lay here till the doctor comes in. Well, what happens if they say we can't be? Oh, here she, here's the doctor. Hi, Dr. Nora. So what's, what's the what? Um, well, girls, I don't see where you had a bonk on your head, so I'm going to suggest that you stay here, though, for some observation. Plus, we can't release you until we know for sure 
that your parents aren't going to claim you. Oh, huh, well, how long do we have to stay here? Oh, maybe a month or so. A month? Are you crazy? We don't want to stay here a month. Nope, nope, nope. Um, well, I'm very sorry, but this is the protocol. You guys can stay in this super comfy room, though, and, um, there's a snack machine, and, of course, you'll get three meals a day. Okay, Dr. Nora. I just don't really want to stay here for that long. I, I don't know what happened to me, but I, I want to start my life. I understand, but this month is absolutely necessary, and who knows? Your parents might actually come claim you. You give the best to retro vibes in the world. Girls, um, be careful. We're starting to go stir crazy. We can't stay at this hospital any longer. Well, it's been a month and no one's claimed you. We can't have these kids running around like this, Dr. Nora. I'm sorry, but I don't have anywhere else to send them until the month is up. Well, the month is up. I've been counting down the days, the minutes, the seconds. They're just running around and being loud and disturbing all the patients. Well, I guess we could send them to the adoption center. You better hurry up with that, Dr. Nora. Hurry up, or you're fired! Actually, girls, I was thinking maybe I could adopt you. Seriously? Molly, I'm home from my shift, and, and did you pack? We're about to go on our beach vacation. Ah, uh, beach, Meech. I'd rather just hang out here with my friends. Molly, now that you're a teenager, you just never want to hang out with Dad and I anymore. Yeah, don't be lame, Molly. Oh, Daisy, you're such a goody two-shoes. Molly, hurry up and go up and get your bathing suit and get packed. Dad will be home any minute. Woohoo! I'm on vacation. I'm gonna sing a song about it. Dad, you're so embarrassing. Hey, this is my house, and I'll sing a lame song if I want to. You think I sounded like Elvis right there? Uh, no, not exactly. Come on, girls. Let's hurry. I want to go to the beach. I do, too. Come on, Molly. Go get your bag packed. Wait, she didn't pack her bag? Of course she didn't. This is Molly we're talking about. Fine, I'll go get my bag. Every year we've mentioned going to the beach to Molly, and every year she doesn't want to go. This is the first year we've actually made her go. I know, we've gone to Disney World, we've gone to France, we've gone all over, but Molly never wants to set foot in the ocean. Maybe it's because that's where she had her amnesia episode. She doesn't remember anything before that. That could be. Maybe she's just like traumatized by that event, but I think it'd be good for her to face it. Besides, going to the beach is so much fun. Is she going to miss out on that for the rest of her life? Good point, honey, but we'll just be there for her if she needs it. Exactly. Molly, aren't you going to get in the water? It's going to be so fun. It's going to feel so good to go swimming. Not a chance. I hate it here. This is exactly where we were when... When... I couldn't remember where our lives were before. I know, but that was a long time ago, Molly. And now we have a great family with good parents. I think we can let that go. Maybe you can let it go, but I'm not letting it go. I hate that part of my life. I hate that I can't remember anything. I don't remember any of it either, Molly. But I do know that moving forward is what we need to do. Speak for yourself. I don't want to move forward. I want to know what happened to me before I was five years old. And why neither one of us can remember it? Don't you think that's kind of weird? I mean, how do we both get amnesia at the same time? Something really, really strange is going on here. And I don't like being here. It, it reminds me too much of it. Ah, now isn't this the life... Oh, I love coming to the ocean. I've missed it so much. I'm gonna go get in the water, even though Molly's such a chicken. I'm not a chicken. I just don't want to, okay? All right, Molly, fine. I understand. Um, Daisy, don't be mean to your sister, okay? It's her choice if she wants to go in the water or not. Thanks, Dad. I knew you were my favorite. <laughs> Molly, you wanna roast some s'mores or something? Sounds good to me. I mean, roast marshmallows. Yeah, first you roast the marshmallows, and then you make the s'mores. Ugh, my stomach's growling, so I'm having trouble thinking out everything I was trying to say before I say it. And Dad, just stop right now. You're having a lame dad moment. I know. I used to be so cool, and now I have lame dad moments all the time. Should I tell a dad joke? Will that help? No! No, absolutely not! You don't want to ruin this vacation, do you? 
The water looks amazing. I can't wait to jump in. Ah. Whoa. What's happening to me? What's happening? I, 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 I remember. Molly, it's, 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 it's a sea witch. Sea witch? But she hasn't been in, in Mermaid Land for a hundred years. Well, I'm back. And I need two mermaid babies to be my evil minions. Well, your father and I talked about this before his untimely passing, and the only thing we could think to do was to make you girls human and leave Mermaid Land forever in order to keep you safe. Save what? Become human? But, but Mom, would you come with us? No, I'd have to stay here and fight. The sea witch must go down! Now... You girls must make haste. Head for the shore. What? Mom! We're not leaving you here with that evil witch! Yeah, Mom, we're not doing it! Girls, you have to. You'll be happy as humans, and one day I'll come for you again. Now go! Before the sea witch gets here! Oh my gosh! I finally remember! Molly! What has gotten into you? You're acting like a lunatic right now, Daisy. No, Molly, you don't understand. Why are you screaming my name over and over? Because I, 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 I need you to get in the water. No, not happening, never happening. Molly, I remember what happened to us before we were five years old. Wait, what? I, I can't believe it, but we had a mom and dad and we were princesses. What? <laughs> princesses! Are you serious right now? Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. And I'm not going in the water. Oh, yes, you are, Molly. Put me down, Daisy. Daisy. Ah, Daisy. Oh my gosh, she threw me in the water. I, 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 I. Remember everything. I, I was a mermaid princess and, and the sea witch and it was going to destroy her. Our whole land, including the queen, our mom. Daisy, we have no choice. We, 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 we have to go back. How, Molly? We have, we have human legs now. But our mom and our dad and our entire, our entire world, it's, it's in danger. I, I mean, it might already be destroyed. We've been gone so long. I know, Molly, I know. But we can't breathe underwater anymore, Molly. It's just the way that it is. I mean, and we have a life here now. But we can't just leave mom and dad. They're our real mom and dad. But what about Nora and Bob? Yeah, I mean, they've been good to us too, but, but, okay, yeah. They're also our mom and dad. I don't know what to do. I think we should tell Bob and Nora, I mean, mom and dad, what we remember. Yeah, right. They won't, they won't believe us. We have to try, Molly. Come on. Um, uh, Mom? Dad? Molly, why are you crying? What's wrong? Oh, I think I know what's going on. Did Daisy throw you in the water? Well, yeah, but something terrible's happened. Really? What? What's wrong, girls? What is it? When Daisy and I got in the water, we remembered where we were before we turned five years old. What? You, you do? Well, were you girls okay? Not really. Um, and we're not sure you're going to believe us. Well, of course we'll believe you, girls. Why would you lie? Yeah, girls, you can tell us anything. Not this. This is weird. Nothing's too weird for us, girls. You can tell us anything. Okay, well, we used to be mermaids, and we were also princesses. Wait, what? Say what? Um, are you guys pranking us? See, I told you you wouldn't believe us. No, no, that's not true. We're listening, girls. Okay, well, you see, we had a mom and a dad. They were king and queen of Mermaid Land. But this evil sea witch that had been locked away for a hundred years got out. And she wanted to make us her evil minions. So our parents sent us here, but, so we could be safe. But when we became human, we forgot that we were ever mermaids. Oh, my gosh. They don't believe us, Maggie. Actually, we believe everything you say. We're your parents. We love you guys. And you'll always be our parents. Just like our 
Mermaid parents will always be our parents. We want to save them and we don't know how. I have an idea. We could rent a submarine. Really? You do that for us, Dad? Absolutely. We have to make sure your parents are okay. But I hope you'll come visit us sometime. Because you are, you're our daughters and we love you. This is worse than you girls going off to college. <laughs> Okay, girls, here's the new aquatic vehicle. It's just like a submarine. Seriously? Whoa, this is amazing. We're gonna go make sure that Mermaid Land's okay. Huh, Mom? You really are an amazing mom. Thanks, sweetheart. I really hope you won't forget about Dad and I. Of course we won't. We have two sets of parents now, but we have to make sure our first set is still okay. I totally agree. I can't wait to meet the queen. Well. Let's do this. Oh my gosh. Look at Mermaid Land. It's, it's destroyed. All the houses are gone and, and, and all the stores. And where's my mom and my dad? Where's all the mermaids? Oh my gosh. Everyone is gone. Molly, I have to believe that mom is still alive. I just have to believe it. I do too, but... This doesn't look good, Daisy. Doesn't look good at all. Brains! I want to eat your brains! Ah! I just came here because I had a little bit of a cough and, and I didn't expect the entire hospital to be invaded by zombies! Uh, Molly? Something tells me this isn't a normal hospital. Um, yeah, um, there are zombies everywhere! We have to escape, Daisy. We just have to. We could do this, Molly. We could do this. I know we can. Oh my God, are you a zombie? No, Molly. He's not a zombie. He's just, he's just a regular kid, like playing Roblox and stuff. I don't know who's a zombie and who's not. What's happening? The doors are opening. Crazy, crazy sister. Of course, the doors are opening. All right. Well, see you later, crazy zombies. I'm out of here. You can't eat my brains today. Molly, something tells me they've set up a lot of booby traps. Yep, you already died on one. So didn't you. Yeah, I'd never die in Abby's. This is pretty crazy. Did it! Um, okay, yeah, you can't touch the vents, apparently. Uh, no, because it's literally pumping in the zombie disease. Oh, man! All right, let's try this again. Brains. Delicious brains. Okay, that's a little distracting when I'm trying to, like, survive this obby when you're just saying that, like, a million times. Okay, they stopped, and I've got to go. Yes, finally! Oh, and then I died there! Are you serious? Give me your brains. Come here. Um, no, you're not eating my brains. I don't have enough for both of us. <laughs> oh, boy, Molly. I only have enough to survive doing my homework. You can't eat any of them. Okay, these vents are harder than I thought they would be. And because you have to hurry. Oh my gosh, there's a zombie that's been talking to me about my brains. He'd give him, he'd give him back. He'd spit them out if he ate your brains, Molly. <laughs> really, Daisy? That is so rude. Well, he would think mine were very smart and delicious. Of course he would. Oh God, run. Not another one of these, please. Anything but, oh my God. Ah! Oh my gosh, she ate my brains. Oopsie. Molly, um, something tells me I should try harder. Really, Daisy? Because if I turn into a zombie, it's all over for you. <laughs> running, running, running as fast as I can. Don't let the zombie catch me. Running, running, running as fast as I can. Don't let the zombie catch me. Running, running, running as fast as I can. Don't let the zombie catch me. Okay, she's like behind me so badly, I can't even see where I'm going. Oh, wait. Oh, thank goodness. See you later, alligator. <laughs> wait, did I click the checkpoint? I gotta jump on it, gotta make sure. Wow, Molly, I would have used Power of the Unicorn on that one for sure. Whoa, look at all these syringes. Do you think that they have the cure or they have zombieism in them? Um, by the looks, zombieism. Yep, you died. So did you, Daisy. You're dying a lot in the sabi. It's a little nerve-wracking, Molly. I mean, it's not like 
Flowers are chasing us. Yeah, good point. <laughs> Whoa, I actually beat my sister at one level. That's amazing. It's no wacky because zombies are trying to get us. What? You pushed me into that, Daisy. I did not, Molly. Snap. You have to be very quick. And don't touch the sides. Exactly. Don't touch the sides, Molly. I spend my entire time playing obbies trying to catch up to my sister. Because <laughs> she never waits for me. I'm waiting for you. You're just very slow. See? You're starting back over again from zero. Snap, snap. Oh, snap. <laughs> Checkpoint. Ooh, zombie lava. Cray cray. Daisy, you cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. I'm gonna, oh, I tried to cheat too, too, but I'm not as good at obbies as my sister is, so I totally died. To say that unicorn thing, Molly. You mean power of the unicorn? Okay. Power of the unicorn with their sparkly horn. <laughs> Did it work, Molly? Um, so far, so good. I mean, I don't know. I'm not dead yet. Molly, I think you're actually gonna make it. Go, 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 Molly. And your unicorn, too. Now we have to try to get through this maze. And it's amazing if you can do it. Get it? Amazing. <laughs> I'm so funny. It's not even funny. Could you stop it already, Molly? You're driving me crazy. This, this maze is driving me crazy. Bonkers. Insano. You're going the wrong way, Daisy. I am good at mazes, so I'm going to find my way out way before my sister. See? Go just out. Um, Daisy, you might want to stay in there. There is definitely a giant zombie out here, and um, things are not looking good. Daisy, did you find your way out? Daisy? Daisy? Huh? 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 Oh, you mean I beat you, Daisy? Oh, you're not Daisy. You're not Daisy. There's Daisy. I was wondering when you were going to show up. Hey, zombie guy. What's up? <laughs> Birds. Ah, he ate us. Ah! Ew, it's gross in here. Of course it is. Ew, he ate a hand? Okay, Um, I thought they just ate brains. I think they'll eat anything. They're not very intelligent. They're zombies after all. Um, yeah, he definitely ate... Oh my god, there's eyeballs in here! And they're still moving around. This one's fresh! Ew, Molly! Oh, Molly, you died! Bummer. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna win this game! I'm gonna win it. I'm gonna win it. I think I have to jump over here. There we go. Woohoo! Guys, if you've played this game, um, or if you want to play this game, slam the like button. Um, I touched the brains. Oops. Do not touch the brain maze. The brain maze. Oh, God, I touched the brain maze. It's like a delay, though. It's like you, you get to live for an extra three seconds so you can think about what your life was all about. I had a good life. It was a good run. <laughs> I played a, ro a lot of Roblox. All right, okay, I don't think you can go that way because every time I do, I... I fall into those brains and it's just not good. I'm going a different way. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, ah! Okay, I don't know how to get through the brain maze. I don't like it. Marty, what are you doing? Um, nothing. Marty, are you paying to skip the stage? Um, uh, uh, Marty, you cheater! <laughs> yeah, well, I'm not gonna be stuck there forever. Are you crazy? Oh, teeth! Yuck! Molly, you're dying at every stage. Because you're so fast. I'm trying to keep up with you. But I think I just need to go slow. Because when I go too fast, I die. Um, his bones are just definitely zombified. Zombify! Wait, wait! Wait, which way am I going? This way. Okay, I'm trying to get an overhead view because I keep jumping and I keep dying. So obviously I'm jumping the wrong way or something. Wait a minute. I think I've got this. Sometimes if you're dying in a game, you just have to do like overhead. 
Then you can see where you're going. See? Da -da -da -da! I win! You didn't win the game yet, Molly. I know, but I'm working on it. Okay, there's knives inside his stomach. That doesn't even make sense right now. I guess zombies would just eat anything. Yeah, I think you're probably right, Daisy. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa! I got this. I got this. I can do it. Oh, no, I can't. I fell all the way back down to the beginning. Ah! Molly, do you need a cupcake? Do you want my... Yeah, you have a cupcake? No! <laughs> what? That was so rude. What an evil prankster you are, Daisy. Ew. He's been eating a lot of squishy brains. Oh, my feet are sinking in. Gross! Uh-oh. Oh, Molly. You're going to lose, and the zombie is going to eat you forever! Um, I don't want to live here in this thing's stomach, so I really need to, do, like, get myself together here and, um, do a better job. Exactly, Molly, you really do. Oh, Molly, Molly, you did it! One more! <laughs> Good job, Molly. What's happening here? Ah, ew! Poo poo! Gross! Oh, yuck! Ew! Gross! Ew! Gross! Ew! Oh, so gross! Ew! Oh, thank goodness I'm out of that. That was disgusting. It was, Molly. Get to the vent. What vent? I don't see anything. Brains. Give me your brains. Um, is it bad that the zombie bit me? Molly, it's very bad. I don't know where to go. Oh, it's so dark in here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Zombie's after me. A zombie's after me. <laughs> Zombie, zombie, set me free, zombie. Don't chase after me. Wait a minute. Nope, wrong way. Get to the vent. I'm trying to get to the vent, Daisy. I don't know where to go. I don't know. Don't kill me, please. Nope, you are gone, O'Malley. Hmm. I need to, like, peek around in here and see, see where I'm going before I go in there. Get to the vent. I'm trying to get to the vent, but this guy keeps chasing me. Ah! Okay, I died. All right, let me see if I can see where the vent is. Like, um, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna look for it. There's definitely not a vent. I don't see a. I don't see a vent. Do you see a vent, Daisy? I'm looking too. I don't really see one. Okay, it's it's not on that wall. So it's got to be on this wall. Daisy, we can stick together if you want. Yeah, and die. I don't think so. Um. Yeah, he's standing on top of things like a creepy stalker zombie. Oh my god! I'm gonna get killed like again. I don't know where to go! Ah! This part is so hard. O M G. Daisy, where are you going? To the vent, of course. Well, okay, well, the zombie just got me. I hope you got out. You sacrificed me. Brains. Brains! <laughs> yeah, brains. I hear ya. Brains are a good thing when you're hungry. Oh! And you're a zombie. Oh, man. Okay, the vet is probably, like, behind the door or something. No. So it's definitely not to the left. Oh, wait a minute. <gasps> I see it. Okay, I need to go to the left and go up. I just see it on the wall right there. Oh, my God. Why am I stuck? Ah! No, wait, what? Oh, my gosh. I got stuck on something. That was not fair. Okay, that was that was not fair because I got stuck on something. I don't know what. Oh, come on! He comes right out of the dark. I know I can do this, though, because I have a leprechaun behind me. Did you guys see that? That is definitely a leprechaun. Come on! Why? Why, zombies? Why? Um, Molly, I think you're going to keep dying. Wait, nope. There's an angel here, too. I've got a leprechaun. I've got an angel. It, it can't be that bad. Get over here, zombie. I'm tired of you. Get over here. Wait, where's there a rope? I know there's a rope somewhere here. Oh, God, I see the rope. 
I see the rope. Please, 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 please. Don't kill me. Oh, come on. I was so close. Okay, hopefully the zombie is distracted right now. Oh, no. I took the long way around. Oh, oh man. I'm terrible at escaping zombies. So is it the leprechaun, though, so I only feel like a little bad. Um, Molly, don't be rude. Uh, the, the leprechaun would do better than you. What? No, they won't. Okay, stop chasing me, zombie! Oh my gosh, all I have to do is make it up the rope, but he's so huge, he beats me to the rope every time. It's okay, guys. I know this seems ridiculously hard, and you're probably right. It is. But I just have to trick him. Oh, no. <laughs> he definitely tricked me. I think that might be a girl zombie, but I'm not quite sure. Oh, come on, zombie! Come on! Marty, do we just want to agree that you're going to be stuck in this hospital forever? No! No, we do not want to agree to that. Oh, MG! Ugh. I'm getting tired of zombies eating my brains. See, the zombie comes out from where you need to go. So that's what makes it hard because you can't see where you're going with this guy. He's constantly behind you. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god. Get away from me. <laughs> Seriously. I just want to climb the rope. Get away. Get away. No. Get away from me. Oh god. There's a zombie chasing me. I don't know what to do with myself. Oh no. I'm almost at the rope. No. <sighs> don't they have something in here where you can like neutralize the zombie or something? Like Get the zombie stuck on the hospital bed or something like that. No. Zombie knows where it's going at all times. Now I'm turned around. I don't know where the rope is. I'm not going to ever get out of here. Please, I just want to escape. I just want to escape. No, come on. I'm almost there. This is rude. This is rude, zombie. This is rude. This time, I feel like I'm going to do it, guys. I think I could really do it. I, I am channeling all of my inner gamer and i'm a pretty good gamer i think well maybe not because this zombie keeps chasing me and eating my brains and i don't, I don't know what to do about it okay there's the rope there's oh no oh! <laughs> okay i don't know how many times i've died by this zombie today if you guys want it um count you can rewind this video and try come on zombie come on where's zombie here's zombie you can do it, Molly. I know you can. Okay, I might just have just enough time to get to get up. Nope, I didn't. Get over here, zombie. You're really starting to irritate me. You gotta get the zombie, like, stuck on something. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> this is one of the hardest parts of an obby ever! A thousand times later. <laughs> if you're still watching, you are a amazing Star Squad fan because you have stuck with me through this very, very hard ending to this obby. And I just think you guys are amazing for that. Oh my god, this zombie's right behind me. Oh yes! Finally! Daisy, I survived! Wow, Molly, this video is gonna be three hours long. I, I, I can't I can't even say it's not gonna be because it probably will but we are like down in the sewers right now I think and I died again <laughs> but I, I've almost escaped right Daisy uh yeah sure Molly you've almost escaped it took you three hours to get past that zombie hey that was a very hard part of this obby all right I gotta take these pipes over checkpoint Okay, where do I go now? Ooh, up these ladders here or something. Okay, no pushing! Look, you almost pushed me off the edge. That would have been very, very bad. I wonder if you guys played this game, how long it took you to get past that zombie. It took me what seemed like forever. What is, is this the escape? I think it is, Molly. I think it is. Run home. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. The zombie's going to be after us now. I can tell already. Oh, God. There he is. Why? Why does this keep happening to me? 
Please! <laughs> I just want to get home! Daisy, I'm following you because you seem to know where you're going, but maybe not. He's right after me, Daisy! Oh! Manny, we did it! We're home! Oh my gosh. This obby was super, super hard! But I completed it, and I feel like the boss right now. Oh, look, there's a slide. I mean, I could go down a slide even though there's a zombie apocalypse happening right outside my backyard. Who cares, right? Whee! Hey, guys, thanks so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe. Yeah, um, you... Oh, my God, I thought that was a zombie. No, Maddie, it's not a zombie. Can you stop interrupting me? Um, if you want to see more crazy videos, then make sure you subscribe because we play lots of fun Roblox games. Yeah, that's right, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye! I'm starving! Wait a minute, what's this? <gasps> a s'more! You ate it on me, Daisy! Sylvie, I'm hungry too! Wow, have I died and gone to heaven? This place is amazing! There's cotton candy and ice cream and gummy bears and a s'more. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, I don't feel so good. Molly, you're getting really chubby. What are you doing? Apparently, I'm eating too much. Ooh, pizza! What's in here? I hope there's more food. <laughs> I'm gonna eat all the food. Molly, seriously, save some for everybody else, piggy. <laughs> oh, a taco! Okay, if you had your choice between a taco, um, a gummy bear, pancakes, or a cupcake, what would you choose? Oh, look at this. There's some cherry pie. Mm, yum, yum, yum. Delicious. Holy guacamole! Look at me, guys! <laughs> I think I may have eaten too much. Molly, you better go to the gym now. No way! I'm looking for more food. I have no idea where Daisy is. I'm around here somewhere just eating a lot of food. <laughs> Ooh, a cheeseburger! Yum, 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 yum. I love that this ice cream cone is so big that you could stare on top of it. Ha! <laughs> Ooh, a taco! I want to eat everything. I want to eat everything. Victory! Does that mean I ate way too much? <laughs> Why is the ground shaking right now, Daisy? There's a giant, epic, chubby guy, and he's trying to kill us all. What? Yeah, Molly, he will, he will demolish you. Well, I'm going to hide in this building. Does it seem like a good place? Molly, no, you have to keep running. I can't run. I ate too many cupcakes. Ah! Ow! Oh, Ow! Oh, I'm down for the count, Daisy! Molly, watch out! Chubbs is gonna get you! OMG! Yeah, we totally died. Molly Chubbs got us. Oh, I was having so much fun eating all those cupcakes. <laughs> oh, Molly, that's all you ever think about. Your stomach. Okay, well, this game is all about thinking about your stomach. <laughs> my kind of game. I'm going to teach you all for stealing my snacks! Ha 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 ha! Molly, what's going on? Punch, punch! Ha ha ha! Molly, you're epically huge! Molly, are you Chubbs? <laughs> I'm Chubbs, and I'm about to get you all! Molly, seriously? Ooh, a snack! Molly! I am no longer your sister! I am super scary, super villain Chubbs! Where is everybody? We're hiding from you! You're making an earthquake! Oh, I see somebody. Come here. Come here, you. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Molly! What? I'm just having fun. Molly, that's a not a nice way to have fun. Being a giant, epic, super, super fatty who's running around and killing everybody. Yeah, that's what I meant. I make earthquakes wherever I go. But seriously, in real life, you probably shouldn't eat that many cupcakes. You just stomach ache. <laughs> Thanks for the warning, Molly. Okay, the earthquake stops when I stop running, so it's definitely me making the earthquake. Of course it is! Jeepers, you're like a Godzilla. <laughs> oh, I can beat apart these buildings. Oh, oh! Everybody's gonna die! Really, Molly, you're just saying that? <laughs> smash, smash! I feel like the Incredible Hulk. Uh-oh! Oh, I just killed two people. Oops. Molly! What? It's my job. I'm Chubbs. OMG! If you guys think I can get every person alive, 
slam that like button if you think I can kill them all. Slam it, guys. Slam the like button. Oh, I'm just beating up all these. Ow, I got a board stuck on my head. <laughs> okay, that was kind of funny. Oh, where are you? Oh, there's one. <laughs> I haven't found Daisy yet, I don't think. Daisy, did I kill you? No, I didn't die yet, Molly. You're never going to find me. I only have 50 seconds to find Daisy. And then demolish her. <laughs> oh, wow. I'm even knocking over the cotton candy trees. <laughs> wow, Molly. That sounded psycho. Well, if you guys would stop eating all the snacks, maybe I wouldn't have this problem. Daisy, come out here. Where are you, Daisy? I'm right here, Molly. Come get me. I am going to come get you. <laughs> Whoa, Daisy, you're chubby too. What up, Molly? Stop eating so many cupcakes. You can't get me, Chubs. <laughs> I wouldn't say that, Daisy. <laughs> Goodbye, Daisy. Molly, how could you? I'm your sister. What? I got everybody, what, one person? Ah! Molly, it's okay. Oh, one person survived. Yeah, you did good, though, Molly. Even though you were kind of this scary monster. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. It's like Halloween. This is so cool. I love all the pumpkins. Have I told you guys how much I love pumpkins? Seriously, they're my favorite part of fall. I kind of can't wait till fall now, so there's just like tons of pumpkins. Molly, why are you so obsessed with a pumpkin? I don't know. I just really like pumpkins, okay? What's wrong with that? Huh? 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 <laughs> Molly, are you chubs this time? Nah. I gave up my career as a supervillain. I'm just a regular villain now. Molly! <laughs> no, I'm not Chubbs. Well, I guess I'm not. I mean, I sort of am. Look at me. <laughs> Molly, you're eating all the candy, rude. This is what you do when you trick or treat. Trick or treat, smell my feet. Give me all the candy to eat. Oh, brother. <laughs> um, an earthquake is coming. Ah! Was that Chubbs right there? Um, yeah, I think it was. Okay, I have to go high, guys, because. If Chubbs comes anywhere near you, you die. Did you have to sing it, Molly, like it's an opera? You die. <laughs> ah, Chubbs is right behind me. Oh, my gosh. Got to run. Got to run. Got to run. Got to run. Can't run because I'm too chubby. Ate too many candy. Oh, brother Molly. Daisy, are you still alive? Of course I am, Molly. Chubbs can never get me. Daisy, there you are. I'm so glad to see you. Ah, no, Daisy, help. Chubbs is going to kill me. Daisy! Okay, I hope Daisy makes it. I'm gonna check in on Daisy and see if she's gonna make it. Okay, there's Chubbs. She looks super friendly for being an evil killer. <laughs> she's wearing a rainbow shirt. That's so cool. Daisy? I'm still alive, Molly! I don't see you. I can only look at Chubbs, basically. Whoa, Molly, they're right after me! Daisy, run! Run, Daisy! Molly, I'm, it's me and one other person that's still alive. Yeah, and you're about to die because here comes Chubbs right after you. Molly, help! I can't, Daisy. I'm dead. Duh. Save a pumpkin for me, though. Molly! It's too early for pumpkins. Not early enough, actually. What? What are you even talking about? I mean, I could have pumpkins, like, on, on my front porch, like, for Halloween all year long. I just love pumpkins. Oh, brother Molly. <laughs> Do you love pumpkins as much as you love cupcakes? Oh, no. There's nothing I love more than a, than a cupcake. Oh, Daisy, you're the last one alive. You've got to hold out for 25 seconds. You got this, Daisy. You got it. Oh, my God. Chubbs is right behind me, Molly. What do I do? Run. pretty cool hey guys i wanted to tell you about our new merch store star squad dot shop where you can get t-shirts like this one i'm wearing for right here but like in real life wouldn't that be cool it has a faces on it 
<laughs> guys, you can also get pillows, backpacks, piggy shirts. There's some super cool stuff there. So if you want to check it out, make sure you click the link in the description box below this video. Welcome to your first night shift at the toy shop. It's your job as a security guard to make sure no one robs the place. If you hear any noises, go check it out. Also, make sure to keep the power off as it can cause, well, um, uh, problems. Have a nice day. I think this is going to be pretty easy. Well, Molly, what? why are you so tall? <laughs> I guess I had a growth spurt or something. Like guacamole, you'd like a giant. <laughs> I can't believe we got a job as um, security guards at a toy shop. This is so cool. Yeah, but look at that guy over there. He's really creepy. Mr. Funny Dunny, Dummy, I can talk. Well, he is a little creepy. I'd much rather have a teddy bear. Too bad. I'm getting you a Mr. Funny Dummy. <laughs> That's what you're getting for Valentine's Day. You better not. Molly, seriously, sorry, I was a little distracted. You're so tall. Yeah, get over it. You're short. I'm I'm tall, and you're not. Oh, rude. All right, let's go into the staff only um section because I'm sure there's treats in there. Molly, they don't give you treats. It's pretty dark in here. I can use my flashlight if you want. That's a great idea. This place is a little creepy. Um, so, uh, I don't see any of the treats. Molly, just because you got a job here doesn't mean they're going to give you treats. Oh, that seems kind of, like, rude. There, I turned on the power. Now it won't be so creepy. And maybe we can find the cupcakes. Molly, when they give you a job somewhere, they don't give you snacks. Well, what do they expect from me, then? They're going to give you money for working here. Wait, what, 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 what was that? Sounded like it came from the shop floor. I don't know. We probably should go check it out. Maybe they're dropping off the cupcakes. Wait. Where, 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 where did Mr. Funny Dummy go? What are you talking about? He's right there. <gasps> that giant dummy is gone. I know, Molly. It, it's sort of creeping me out a little bit. Oh, I'm sure somebody just moved it. Probably as a prank. I don't know, Molly. That guy was really weird. Hey, look. We can go up here. Daisy, come on, let's let's go up here. Molly, we can't reach. We're not tall enough. Well, somebody stand here, and I'll jump on their head. Okay, okay, that didn't work. Okay, Daisy, um, we can't go up there. No kidding, Molly. Oh wow, if you go through here, ow, it hurts. Be careful, Molly. Be careful. It's sort of like an abbey. Whoa, this job got way more serious all of a sudden. Where is my cupcakes? Oh boy, Molly. You really don't get it, do you? You can buy your own cupcakes with the money they pay you. Yeah, that's probably true. Pull lever. Molly, that dummy is going to show up here. I just know it. Molly, hurry! That lever made platforms. And if you don't, you don't jump on them, you die. Well, I made it. <laughs> Which is surprising because usually when I play games like this, all I do is spend all of my Robux. Funny game one? I don't know if I, I think this game is funny at all. What happened to the lights? I, I hear something in the distance. I don't know, Molly, but I think there's only one way out, so we probably should go look. Um, I'm going this way with my sister. <laughs> you guys can go that way. Molly, do you think Mr. Funny is in the shadows? Daisy, why are you so paranoid about Mr. Funny? Because this was called Mr. Funny's Toy Shop. Oh, yeah, this probably does have something to do with that giant, creepy toy dummy. Absolutely, Molly. This is like a maze. You can never get out of it. I'm going to get out of it. I'm smarter than Mr. <laughs> Funny. Ah! Ah! That creeped me out! Holy guacamole, that was terrifying. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, my God. Ah, that gave me a heart attack. <laughs> Molly, did Mr. Funny get you? Yeah, it wasn't funny at all. It was terrifying. I was like, who's that behind me? And when I turned around, it was Mr. <laughs> ah! There he is again! Okay, this is creeping me out. <laughs> okay, I can tell already I'm not going to get past game one. Maybe if I just keep running super fast. <laughs> 
I don't think I can yet. Ah, there he is again! Ah! <laughs> oh my god. I keep screaming because it just creeps me out. Okay. Guys, if this game creeped you out, let me know in the comment section below. Maybe if I don't turn on my flashlight, he won't get me. Maybe he's attracted to the light. Oh my god! Oh my god, I can run faster than him, right? Ah! Mr. Funny, stop it. We could be friends. I mean it. We could be friends. <laughs> he moves. So creepy. <laughs> OMG. Why you following me, Mr. Funny? <laughs> I can't even talk right now. Oh, my God. I just made it to the exit. Daisy! Molly! Close the door! Oh, my gosh. Did Mr. Funny get you a bunch of times? Yeah! I literally almost had a heart attack. It was so scary. Guys, if you don't like jump scares, this is not the game for you. Okay, I'm going to go over here. I don't know where it goes, but... Oopsie! Not that way. Okay, let's see. If we go up here... Oh, that looks like a way out, but we can't get over there. And then up here. And then here. Come on, Marty. You can do this. And then up here. Yes! Oh, thank goodness, Molly. I thought I was going to lose you to Mr. Funny forever. He is not funny. There is nothing funny about Mr. Funny. Agreed. Ah! Oh, man! Daisy, I just, I just died in the most horrible way. I see that, Molly. Definitely don't go down there. Oh, no, I'm going to do it again. Ah! I got smushed by the rollers. Mr. Funny's toy shop is not funny. It's terrifying, actually. Oh, God! No! Molly, you didn't even make it to Funny Game 2. I, th I don't think I want to. I think, I think, no. I'm thinking no. Whoa. Yes, I finally made it. Nope, just kidding. I died. <laughs> Molly. <laughs> Seriously. You stink. Yeah, a little bit. I think it's because I'm just like, I got really frazzled when I saw Mr. Funny or whatever his name is. Because he is creepy times a million. I couldn't agree more, Molly. He is pretty creepy. Oh, you finally made it. Um, Daisy, does this look like red light, green light to you? It does, Molly. It does. This is the game of red light, green light? Yeah, Molly. So when he's not looking, run! Perfect. Oh, Daisy, you got eliminated. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if I want to get to the other side. He's so... Creepy! Ha ha ha! Take that, Mr. Funny. <laughs> ah! He got me again! Ah! <laughs> His face is so creepy. Oh, man. Okay, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I need a cupcake. <laughs> is Daisy back? I don't, I don't know if that's Daisy over there. I'm not moving. I'm not moving till that head turns all the way around. Great. Ah! Why do you keep getting me, Mr. Funny? Molly, everything's going to be okay. Just try your best. Would you like to buy a ninja star? I think I really would. I'm going to stop way ahead of time. So that way, like right now, so that way I don't get killed. Because I don't know about you, but I cannot see Mr. Funny's face again. He's going to give me nightmares, Mr. Funny. Don't get me. Oh, oh, that was a close one. Molly, I'm over here. Oh, Daisy. Oh, I'm so glad to see you made it. Yeah, I was really, really scared when Mr. Funny's face was like right up in mine. Holy guacamole. Ha ha! Can we move now? Yeah, Molly, he can't get you. Um, Mr. Funny, you are creepy. I can't even talk when I say that. It's going to be okay, Molly. I never knew you to be so afraid of a game before. Well, this one's no ordinary game. Okay, I think if we go for here. And then, Molly, this way. I can help you if you want. Um, like this. And then... Totally did it! Okay, press for the elevator. Here we go, Molly! Do you think Mr. Funny's going to be up here? Absolutely. 
Okay, I'm just gonna hide inside this box then forever. Molly, I still see you. Um, oh, sorry. I'm hiding forever. Molly, I still see you. Other arm. Um, that box isn't big enough for you. Oh, Mr. Funnies. Game number three. Ugh. Looks like a survival game. I'll have to avoid the giant robot by climbing on those blocks. Giant robot? What are they talking about? I don't see a giant robot. Um, Molly, just be careful. Get to a safe place in nine seconds. Okay, I have to say that this is a really inventive game. It's also scaring me to death, so... Okay, this is as high as I can... Oh my god! It's a Mr. Funny Robot! Uh-oh, am I up high enough? I hope so. Oh boy, he's knocking everything over. Oh no, this is gonna be bad, Daisy. This is gonna be bad. He is evil! Mr. Robot! Ah! Oh my gosh! He just took my head off! Okay, I've gotta get somewhere where he's not gonna break down the blocks. I think Daisy already made it through. She's so lucky. I'm the only one that's left here with that creepy... Oh my god, I only have one second and he's coming out here! Oh boy. Oh boy, I'm dying. I'm not gonna die. I'm not gonna die. I'm not gonna die! That's what I need to say to myself. Hey, Mr. Funny. This isn't funny. Oh man, I need to survive for 29 more seconds? Just, just leave me alone! You don't have to do this! You don't have to be this mean! Oh my god. Ah, we gotta run fast. Oh, Mr. Funny's closing in. Uh-oh, he ran me over. <laughs> Oopsie. Oh. Okay, it's saying I have to wait. I could buy a jetpack. That might be worth my money, actually. Just so I can escape Mr. Funny. If you guys haven't played this game yet, I highly recommend it. It is um, creepy, but very fun. Oh my god, no! Don't let me fall! Oh! When I said it was really fun, it's also a little frustrating because when Mr. Funny tries to kill you, um, he succeeds. <laughs> Maybe he won't know I'm over here. Yeah, that's a good plan. I'll hide on Mr. Funny. Uh -huh. da -da 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 -da. He doesn't know where I am. Ha 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 ha, Mr. Funny. Do you think it's funny that I, I'm hiding from you? <laughs> okay, at least he can't squish me over here. Oh my god, I only have to make it 50 more seconds. 12, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, I died at the last second. Are you serious right now? All right, one last attempt, guys. I think I can actually do it this time. I'm hoping. All right, I'm going to go over here. Um, I'm actually just going to hide. So what I'm going to do. I'm going to hide from Mr. Funny. See, there's Mr. Funny. And he knows exactly where I am, but I don't know how. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm going to die. Why me? Why me? Where is he? Oh, there's a lot of people in here right now. So they're just, like, trying to escape Mr. Funny, too. Oh, my God. It's not funny. It's not funny anymore, Mr. Funny. You're not funny. You're not funny even a little. Okay, now they're going over that way. Oh, please, please don't catch up with me. There's the exit. OMG. I might actually exit. You survived. <laughs> Marley, finally. Are you ready for the next part? Ah, why'd you push me, Daisy? Sorry. Ah! Is this the exit? Please let it be the exit. Please. No way of knowing, Marley. But there's only one way to find out. It looks like... A really dark warehouse? This would be a good time to use my flashlight. Oh no, we're still not out of here. Molly, um, I think we're going to be stuck. Forever, there's Mr. Funny! Ah! Ah! I'm going to be late for school. And I actually did my homework, so I want credit for it, you know? <laughs> Where's my math book? Where's my math book? Oh, I can't find my math book. Okay, um, maybe I left it in the chair. No, where was I studying last night? Think, Molly, think. Oh, wait, I had to go to the bathroom. Maybe it's in the toilet. Are you down there? 
Just kidding. Although sometimes I'd like to um, flush all of my school books down the toilet. No, it's not on the desk. Wait, what's that on the table? I think it's my math book. Yep, it, sh it sure is. I'm just going to pick it up, put it in my backpack, and away I go. Molly, hurry up. The bus is here. Coming. Good morning, everyone. It's good to see you here, especially you, Molly. You're actually on time. <laughs> yeah, and I did my homework. Can you believe it? Oh, my gosh. What'd you do with Molly? Who are you? <laughs> Guys, today, mathlete tryouts are happening. I know all you mathletes would be amazing at that. Yeah, uh, more work and homework. Uh, I don't know about that. Hey, Molly. <laughs> it's good to see you. Uh, I sat next to you. Oh, <laughs> um, yeah, I see you sat next to me. S sitting in that chair is, is nice. Oh, really? Why? Um, uh... Is it because I, I'm sitting next to you? No, 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 that's not why. <laughs> it's because you're sitting under the heat duct, and so you stay nice and toasty. Oh, <laughs> I see. Okay, class, please take out your math books. We're going to go over lesson number three. Math book, math book, math book. Wait, here it is. O-M-G. I accidentally brought my diary. Oh, my gosh. It talks all about my crush in it. Okay, I'll just put it back in my backpack and tell the teacher I forgot my math book. Did Molly just say that she brought her diary to school? <laughs> I bet there's some awesome secrets in there she doesn't want anyone to know. And that's exactly why I have to read it. <laughs> when her back's turned, I'll steal it right from her backpack. Mrs. Stevens, I forgot my math book. I'm sorry. I, I, I brought the wrong book with me, but I did my homework. It's okay, Molly. Do I have to have detention? No, you don't have to have detention. Really? I finally managed to not get detention. I'm super proud of myself right now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Molly has a crush on Luke? <laughs> this is perfect. Dear Luke, meet me in the auditorium after school. Love, Molly. <laughs> Dear Molly, meet me in the auditorium after school. Love, Luke. Perfect. <laughs> I'm going to prank her so good. <laughs> hey, Molly, you could share math books with me if you want. Really? Wow. Uh, Thanks, Luke. No problem. Okay, class. You guys can head off to English. I don't want you to be late. Yeah, that would be a tragedy. <laughs> Are you even paying attention? Hello? Is she sleeping? Huh? What? Huh? Wake up! Huh? What? what I miss? Pretty much all of English class. Here, Luke wanted me to give you this letter. Really? Yeah, he said it's pretty urgent. Okay, thanks. No problem. Don't say I never did anything for you. Wow, a letter from Luke? I wonder what it says. Dear Molly, please meet me in the auditorium after school. Love, Luke. O-M-G. I think he's going to ask me to the school dance. Best day of my life. Okay, everyone. Class is dismissed. Wow, it's the end of the day. <laughs> Guess I need to meet Luke in the auditorium. Oh, my God. There's Luke. I'm kind of nervous. He makes me feel, like, really shy because I really have a crush on him. Hey, Molly. Oh, hi, Luke. Hey, um, so, uh, you wanted to meet me here? Wait, what? No, you wanted to meet me here. Uh, no, Molly. Um, I got your letter. <laughs> I didn't write you a letter. You wrote me a letter. No, you wrote me a letter. Sarah gave it to me. Attention, Molly and Luke. What is going on? This is Sarah, and I want you to know that <laughs> I read your diary, Molly. Ah! What? <laughs> That's right. I'm going to read you guys a little bit of what Molly said. No, Luke, cover your ears. You don't want to hear this. What? Why? And why'd you write me that letter, and now you're saying you didn't? I didn't write you the letter. I'm guessing that Sarah wrote you a letter from me. And then she wrote me a letter from you. Why would she do that? Oh, 
I can only take a guess. Okay, here you go. Dear diary, Luke is so cute. Huh? You wrote this, Molly? No, I, I don't know what you're talking about. This is really Molly, diary. It's not Daisy or baby Kira. I really like Luke. He's cute. He's adorable. He's smart. He is like a amazing football player. Love, Molly. Oh my gosh, I'm humiliated. <laughs> By the way, losers, I have locked you into the school for 24 hours. <laughs> have fun. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I'm mortified. I'm so embarrassed. I can't believe she stole my diary and read it out loud. Hey, Molly. Ah, what are you doing here? This is the girl's bathroom. Well, no one else is around, and, 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 and you ran away before I could even say anything. Wow, the girl's bathroom is much bigger than the boys. OMG, get out of here! Um, wait, I just want to tell you something. I, I like you too. Wait, what? You do? Yup, I do. I think you're cute, and amazing, and smart, and funny, even if you don't do your homework. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. And I'm kind of glad that I'm stuck in the school with you for 24 hours. We can have, like, a first date. This is a date? Yup. If you want it to be, that is. I totally do. Aww. Maybe we should go to the cafeteria and, well, eat pizza. I love that idea! <laughs> Let's eat all the pizza so that they don't have any for lunch tomorrow and they'll be like, where's all the pizza? And we can secretly laugh inside because we'll know the answer and they won't. Wow, complex, Luke. Okay, let's do it. I always thought you were kind of simple, but now seems you have a whole plot line going here. Ooh, this pizza's delicious. Mm, it totally is. Molly, I hope that we can be the best of friends. Me too, Luke. Mm, this is really good. So, um, what do you want to do now? Uh, eat more pizza. <laughs> Duh. Molly, I never knew somebody that liked pizza as much as you. Well... We're going to eat it all so all the students wonder where it goes tomorrow. You better get eating, Luke. Um, yeah, I'm full already. <laughs> I can totally eat more pizza than you. <laughs> hey, want to go to the gym and play some basketball? Sounds like a great idea, except for I just ate all that pizza. I'll probably throw up. Nah, it'll be fun. Come on. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. I forgot where the gym was for a minute. <laughs> all that pizza went to my brain. Okay, let's see if I'm better at basketball than Luke. Um, you probably are. I'm really good at football, though. I'm not really great at football. Whoa, good shot, Luke! I'm having so much fun right now. Me too. Um, Luke, um, we didn't think about something. What's that, Molly? Where are we gonna sleep? Um, well... Ugh, I don't feel so good. Why? Oh, no. You ate too much pizza, and then you jumped around playing basketball. Uh-oh. I don't want to throw up on our first date. That would ruin everything, wouldn't it? Um, you better run to the boys' bathroom. <laughs> I'll set up a sleeping area. Good idea, Molly. We definitely have to sleep here till the morning. Wait a minute. No students allowed. <gasps> Perfect! Yes! In the janitor's room, there's a bunk bed. I'll let Luke choose if he wants top bunk or bottom bunk. Are you feeling better, Luke? A little. I don't know why I ate all that pizza. <laughs> <laughs> um, Luke, I was wondering, um, are you having fun on our date? I'm having a great time on our date. Yep. Well, I want to show you something. Uh, I'm not looking forward to sleeping on the bleachers. No, no, no. Look what I found in the janitor's room. Bunk beds! Do you want the top bunk or the bottom bunk, Luke? I'll take the bottom. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. This ladder is kind of broken. I can't climb up the ladder. Uh, uh, uh. Here, Molly, I'll take the top bunk. Are you sure, Luke? Well, if I can climb up the ladder, sure. Well, Molly, this was a great first date. I agree. But you know we're probably going to get detention tomorrow for being locked inside the school. But it wasn't our fault. We'll just tell them Sarah did it. Yeah, if they believe me. I'm always getting detention. Plus, we ate all the pizza for school tomorrow. 
Yeah, we might get detention about that. But at least we'll be in detention together. And uh, Molly? Yeah, Luke? Would you like to go to the school dance with me on Friday? Um, uh, uh. It's okay if you don't want to. I would love to! Great. This 24 hours stuck in the school with you has been the best 24 hours of my life. Ditto, Luke. Ditto. All right, Violet and Scarlet, are you ready for our very first family vacation? I don't know. I want to go back to bed. Oh, Scarlet, don't say that. You love vacation. Well, I mean, I don't know yet because this is your first one, but I'm sure you're going to. Yes, yeah, Scarlet, don't be such a grumpy goose. It's going to be fun. Whatever, Violet, you're annoying. Okay, item number one is no arguing on family vacation. That's going to be impossible, Mommy. Yeah, especially with a sister like her. Okay, girls, that is rule number one, no arguing. Rule number two, let's have fun, fun, fun. Now, did I pack enough diapers? I'm ready for vacation! <laughs> I've had three years with babies, pooping, bottles, and sleepless nights. I need a vacation more than anyone ever needed on this entire planet. Well, honey, why are you wearing your bathing suit? We haven't even gotten on the plane yet. Oh, I don't know. I, I, I didn't think about that part of it. I was just thinking about vacation! Somewhere sunny, with palm trees swaying in the breeze. Ah, <laughs> Daddy, you're so funny. What's a palm tree? Oh, it's a special type of tree that grows in the, in the warm parts of the country. And I don't know, you'll just have to see when you get there. They're pretty amazing, though, because it means coconuts! Okay, Dan, I think you've gone a little crazy. He's totally crazy, Mommy! Okay, well, I'm going to go get our suitcase. We don't want to be late for our flight. You girls be good and stay right here. Totally! <laughs> Mommy says stay right here. I can go high. Then we're going to be late and she's going to laugh. <laughs> or cry. I don't know. See you can't find me. Scarlet, we're... Scarlet, come on! We're going to miss our flight! Scarlet, where are you? She naughty, Mommy. I know, Violet. She can be very naughty sometimes. Scarlet, come out here right now. You can't find me, Mommy. You can't find me. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I've lost my twin. Oh, no. Wait a minute. Is that her over there in the washing machine? Ugh, Scarlet, get out of there right now. <laughs> Mommy, was it laughy, laughing? No, it wasn't a moment of laughing. Come on. We're going to be late. Okay, we go now. Come my annoying sister. Whatever, you're the naughty one. I'm the best identical twin. I uh, show sure you are, Violet. You're boring. Oh, this weather's terrible. Um, I'm rethinking my choice about wearing swim trunks. Um, freezing out here. I don't have any shoes. <laughs> oh, Dad, I think you're turning into a popsicle. Or like a brick of ice. Dan, are you okay to drive? You look like, well, maybe you've been frozen to death. Uh, my hands are frozen. Why are you wearing a bathing suit? We live in Brookhaven. We have winter here. I don't know. Oh my gosh, just turn on the heat so you defrost. Boy, play. This sounds amazing. Woohoo. Whoa, this is nice. Are you warmed up now, Daddy? Yeah. <laughs> this was worth my entire life savings to take this private flight. Oh, yeah. I don't even have to wear shoes or socks. <clears throat> and I just farted in the seat. Ew, Dad! Hey, I paid for this plane. I can fart in it if I want to. Ew, the whole plane is filling up with gas. Everybody get your parachute. Gross. Okay, wait. Is there an actual parachute? Oh, I think you can actually have a pair with you. Oh my gosh, don't touch! Scarlet, what are you doing? Oh, Scarlet! Uh, don't worry, I have a pair with you. Oh my gosh. She's, she's taking, she's taking a very different way to our vacation, honey. Oh my God, I hope she's going to be okay. Um, Dan, this doesn't look anything like the home away picture that we saw. Um, I don't know what happened. This is the right address. This place stinks! Hey, girls, that's not very nice to say. 
Your father worked very hard for this vacation, and I guess it'll be nicer on the inside than the outside. Yeah, the inside pictures look amazing. Let's go ahead and see it. Uh-oh, the stairs are broken. That's okay. That's still considered outside. Oh, my gosh. It's horrible in here. How come I paid $1,000 a night for this? Uh-oh, Dad's really mad. Hey, quit slamming the door in my face. Violet! <laughs> you couldn't get in. Wow, this place is a dump. There's, oh, ooh, someone left pizza. Don't eat that, Scarlet. That's very old. Is the TV sitting on top of cardboard boxes? Uh, okay, I'm gonna call the owner right now and see what's going on. Ew, the sink is gross. What do the bedrooms look like? I guess they're sort of okay. There's some holes in the walls and stuff, though. Yeah, um, this is your renter for the week. Uh, yeah, the lake house. Uh, could you please call me back as soon as you get this? Oh, man, his mailbox is full. Ugh. Honey, we'll just make the best of it. We haven't had a vacation in over three years. We just need this, okay? Everybody get in your bathing suits and get out to the lake right away. Okay, Mom. That just means Mom doesn't want to hang out inside this this dumpy house. Girls, try to just be good. I'm trying, Mom, but how am I supposed to vacation here? Same way you would anywhere else. Just try not to pay attention to the scenery. <laughs> this one to the lake is a rotten egg. Okay, well, this isn't so bad. Oh, this is actually pretty nice. Splash! Look at me, Daddy! I'm swimming! Don't go too far out into the lake! Ew, is that a dead fish with three eyes? Ew, this lake is contaminated! What? No, it's not, Scarlet. Don't say that. Yes, it is! There's a dead fish and it has three eyes! Oh, my goodness. Scarlet, you're such a troublemaker. Look at this place, Dad. Do you think that this lake is full of toxic sludge? Uh, I do smell something kind of funny. Hey, guys! Let's go in the lake! No, don't do it! Oh, good. You're just sitting down. Why? What's wrong? It's full of toxic slime. Oh, well, I don't... Did you even look at the reviews of this place before we came? Well, we can have a nice fire while we smell the toxic sludge. Oh my gosh, we're all going to go home with an extra arm or an extra eyeball. I just know it. I packed sandwiches. I a sandwich. I have a sandwich. Oh, let's just make it the best of this vacation. The house is kind of, well, garbagey. And the lake smells really weird. But we're going to have a great time, right? Sure we are. I think we'll have a great time. We got those marshmallows. Great idea, Scarlet. Oh, wow. Don't burn your marshmallow, Violet. I mean, Scarlet, which one of, which one of you is which? I, I mix you up all the time. <laughs> He's our dad. He still doesn't know which is which. Dad, I'm Scarlet, the one with the polka dot bathing suit. And I'm Violet, the one with the pink bathing suit. Oh, I really wish I could get in this lake. Oh, well, I'm just going to chance it. Really? Yeah, why not? First, I'm going to catch some rays, and now I'm going to jump in the water. Oh, yeah. But you'll get three eyeballs! I don't care! It's the only vacation I've gotten in three years, and I've changed a lot of poopy diapers in those three years. Three eyeballs or not, I'm swimming in it. Watch out for the dead fish. It's got three eyes. It's creepy. Uh, honey, are you okay? Yeah, why? What's wrong? You have a very strange glow about you. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I feel fine. Honey, you're starting to foam at the mouth. Are you okay? I told you. I'm fine. Ah, mommy looks creepy. Honey, you're looking like a crustacean. Uh, are you sure you're all right? What do you mean? <laughs> I just want to go back in the water. <laughs> oh my gosh. I went into the water for a second. Is that going to happen to me? I don't know. I think Mom may have drank some of the water on accident. I think we just lost your mother for good. She's mutated and turned into some sort of lake monster. And I burned my marshmallow. Worst vacation ever!